It's a toad. Uh, ew. Get away. Shoo. Sh shoo. Get out of my garden. I swear, I just recently had someone come and clear the garden of pests. I guess they missed one. Oh, please don't make me have to pick you up. The very idea oh, makes me want to gag. Oh, it speaks? Oh, if you can speak, then that means you must be able to understand me as well. Then you'll be able to understand that I want nothing to do with you and I would like you to leave my garden at once. Go on then. Chew. Get out of here, you slimy amphibian. What? What? What could you possibly want from me? I do not wish to negotiate with you. I can't even stand the sight of you. Uh, fine, fine. Listen, if you promise to leave, then I will at least hear you out. But please, please make it quick. You're not a toad. Well, then what are you, a frog? I apologize if I don't understand the difference. Both are quite... disgusting. Not a frog, either. Well, then what are you? You're... a royal. Well, congratulations on being ruler of the frogs. I am sure they're very happy to have you as their leader. Now, go on. I've heard you out, and I still do not care for what you have to say. Hop on out of my sight. What, you weren't finished? Uh, well, what else could I possibly care to know? Your frog royalty, and what else? You... Your... <laughs> human royalty? <laughs> yeah, that's a very funny joke. No, I do not believe you are human. You are much too small, green, and warty. You were cursed. Well, great. So not only are you bothering me with this disgusting form, but now you are threatening my life by bringing a curse near me? How disrespectful of you. I cannot believe how inconsiderate you are. Now, hang on just a minute. Royal or not, you have no right to speak to me that way. Well, there really is no reason for that kind of language. Oh, stuck up? Really, me? How dare you? I have been nothing if not merciful this entire time. I should throw you over the wall myself. Oh, honestly. Well, your highness, if you really are cursed, then there's not much I can do about that. Sure, I am well-versed in magic, but I think this might be above my level of abilities. I mean, I wouldn't even know where to look for a cure. You already have one. Oh, well, if you already have a cure, then why are you still cursed? You need another person's help. All right, well, what is it that you need, then? <gasps> Want me to what? Oh, no, 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 no. I am not kissing a slimy, warty, disgusting frog. A kiss is a sacred thing, and I will not be tarnishing my first with this mess. I don't care if you are royalty, I'm a royal myself, and I find you demanding to kiss me to be very rude and extremely forceful. How barbaric do you have to be? I've already said no, so I don't understand why you're still sitting here. I mean, why does it have to be me? Isn't there some peasant who's dying to kiss a royal in whatever form they show up in? It has to be from another royal. How wonderfully specific. Listen, 
surely you could go ask another princess. You could just hop on over to another ship and then sail across the ocean for like a year or two and I'm sure you'll find someone. Selfish? Excuse me for not wanting to kiss a stranger, let alone one of the most grossest creatures alive. And you have not given me a single solid reason for why I should help you. Money. <laughs> Please. I'm a royal, not a fool. I have enough, thanks. Land. Like I need the space. Horses? <sighs> well, now you're just being ridiculous. Books? Oh, well, that's just... What kind of books? Rare books? Mountains of books? Books from different countries? <sighs> so all I have to do is kiss you. What about just a friendly handshake? Perhaps a pat on the back? A friendly game of croquet? No? All right, I get the picture. A kiss on the lips. This means I have to pick you up as well, doesn't it? Well, I'm not about to kneel on the dirt just to get a kiss I don't even want. So I guess that's the only real option. Just a kiss and the books are mine. All right, well, come here then. Ew, 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 please stop moving. I can feel your insides squishing around as I hold you. Oh, okay, okay, don't drop you, don't drop you. You're doing this for books. You are doing this for books. What is so funny? What, you find humor in my distress? I really should toss you over the wall, you brute. I hate frogs, and yet I'm the only princess around that can help you with your predicament. Can you not see how stressful this is for me? You should be more humble in the position that you are in. Honestly. <sighs> Let's just get this over with. Here I go. Any moment now. Just close your eyes and do it. Just a quick peck should do, right? Good. Okay. Okay. It's just a kiss. Don't think about who it's with. Ready? And... <laughs> oh, wipe it off, wipe it off, wipe it off. Oh, so slimy. Did it work? You're still a frog! Were you lying to me? Of all the inconsiderate, horrible... What? It has to be a willing kiss for my princess. Why didn't you lead with that? Why are curses so specific? How could I ever want to willingly kiss a frog? It's disgusting. Oh, I can't believe I just did that. And for nothing? I'm sorry, but there is no way I am doing that again. Look, you seem like a fine something or another, but I can't imagine myself ever willingly wanting to kiss a frog. Even if books are promised. I don't think I can help you. <sighs> don't give me those sad frog eyes. It's weirdly gross and heartbreaking at the same time. Look, I'll tell you what. Maybe, maybe, if I get to know you a little more, 
why you were turned into a frog in the first place, and what you plan on doing once you are free of the curse, then maybe I... No, I still don't think I could do it. But I could possibly look into other ways I could help break your curse. Being a spellcaster and all, I am quite well versed with magic. I don't want to leave you like this, and heaven knows that if the roles were reversed, I would be dreading my existence. Why don't I make us some tea, and we can talk about how we can possibly change you back, all right? You do drink tea, right? I'm sure it will be fine. Come on, then, your highness. We will figure out how to change you back together. 